Crystals of the same substance can have many different forms called allotropes. For example, carbon has many different allotropes. So these three substances right here are all made up of carbon just in different forms or allotropes. So the first is diamonds and this is when atoms are covalently bonded to four atoms. So you have this one carbon atom that's covalently bonded to four neighboring carbon atoms and that makes diamonds and that makes a uh, very rigid and hard structure which is actually the hardest substance on earth. Then there's also graphite which is what uh, pencil lead is made out of and this is when the, the atoms arrange in hexagons and sheets. So these atoms are arranged in hexagons and these hexagons are arranged in sheets that can slide back and forth on each other. And this makes something that's very soft and so that's why it's used for graphite. And then there's this newly discovered substance that is made up of 60 atoms arranged in a hollow sphere almost like a soccer ball. So these are all made up of carbon atoms. I didn't write it in all the descriptions here but that's the atoms we're dealing with here. These are carbon atoms that are covenantly bonded to four neighboring carbon atoms. Graphite is when carbon atoms are arranged in hexagons that are arranged in sheets and this new substance is 60 carbon atoms arranged in a hollow sphere. So this is all made up of carbon but we have three different substances and that's because of allotropes and that's when crystals of the same substance can have different forms. If you need a study guide, click the book at the bottom of the page. If you want more free test videos, subscribe to us on YouTube. If you just want to keep watching, click the next video.